What are we doing here again? We are here to make sure the enemy don't go past this point. But we had to fall back earlier, remember? I have no idea what you're talking about, Haley. Yes, you do, Myla. You were the one who told us to fall back. Nora, shut it! Uh, girls, do you hear that? Uh, yeah, I hear it. Is that the bad guy? No, Nora, that's our teammate. Of course it's the enemy! Stop right there, buddy. Just turn around and walk away. Girls, show this agent what we are made of. <laughs> Pleasure. But, but I... And why shouldn't I do that? B because I didn't want to be a bad Octoling in the first place. Really? Yes! Please don't kill me! I'm begging you! Hmm. Never expected you guys to surrender. No. But I am. Let me get you out of here. Blankly staring into nothing. Oh, uh, yeah, I, I was just thinking about my last mission. How come? Thought it was just a regular mission, as always. It was to be expected. However, this one was different. How so? There was this one octoling that didn't seem to be affected by brainwashing in any way. So what? Some octolings choose to take that path. I'm with four on this. Why is this an issue to you? She said she didn't want to be bad, as she puts it. It's as if she was forced under the influence of the Octarians, even though she wasn't affected by anything. I guess she... Ugh. Whatever. It's not our concern anymore. She's not causing trouble, and that's all that matters. That's the problem. She is our concern. Octolines are never persuaded to join the Octarians. It's always brainwashing that's involved. It doesn't matter. Whether they are brainwashed or not, Octolings can't be trusted. Can't you trust Eight? Agent Eight is an asset to the team. But I can't figure you out. Which means I can't trust you as much as Four. Thanks, Three. Good to know you had my back when Tartar was going to destroy Inkopolis. The who? Did what? I'll tell you later. Anyway, I'm off. Send me a text if you have anything to do. He's impossible! Agent 3 is not making it easy for us to get along. 4, please calm down. I'm just... Ugh, I'm so mad at him! From what I heard, 8 helped him with a mission and saved his life. Twice! But Carter is all like, Ugh, I'll let the links be bad because I'm stuck up in the past. Ugh. You need to understand it from his point of view. Agent 3 has been fighting Octarians for as long as he's known the captain, so he's going to be in that state of mind. I guess you're right. I just wish 3 didn't have to be so cold. You're going to have to live with it. As long as he's doing his job, that's all that matters. Yeah. Anyways, is there a reason why you called me here? Uh, I didn't. You just walked in here and started ranting to me. Oh, never mind. Well... Sorry to hear all that for... Agent 3 stubborn. Not much else can I say. Actually, there is an issue. Do you tell? Agent 8 was telling me and 3 about his last mission, saying that there was one Octoling that wasn't affected by brainwashing. Hmm. That is unusual. Where are they? I'm not sure. 8 said he set them free. He's keeping them out of harm's way. 8 is making a good call. Thanks for keeping me in the loop. Me and Callie will keep an eye on the Octolings around Inkopolis. Thanks, Mari. We'll let you know if there's anything that needs to be reported.
So, there is nothing that will convince you, huh? Agent 4 tried, Mary tried, the Captain tried. You're trying, but not exactly succeeding. Uh, three. You really need to understand that Eight is an asset to our team. No one is asking you to be friends with him. All I am asking of you is to just trust him. It's a little difficult to do so when his species are trying to kill us. How come you are not suspicious of him after what they did to you? If he was trying to kill us, he would have done it already. Haven't heard that before. Three, can you please give Eight a chance? Please. At least for me. No promises. Here's the moody agent I love. Yeah, yeah. You come and relax. Marie wants me back at Tentacule. Something wrong? She just has a mission for us to get to. I'll go see her now. I'll let you know when we're ready. Keep that smile on your face, three.